And welcome to Riverside High School, where your Lady Crusaders are at the good, at the Riverside Lady Vikings. This is the JV game. Holy Cross with a three. Riverside with the ball around. Holy Cross playing man defense. Gets it underneath, dishes back out. Riverside straight up, good block by Ava. Good hustle by Emma Scalise there. And we're gonna have a foul on Chloe Mendocino. We are going to have an injury. Julie's injured. Six minutes left in the first quarter. Shots for Riverside. First one's off to the left. Second one's up. Strong Emma Scalise with the rebound. Starting for Holy Cross, JV team is Trista Ciccoletti. Trista with the three long. Chloe Mendocino, who just got that rebound. Ava, Chloe with a three. Too strong. Emma Scalise and Madison Potter. Cross moving that ball around a little bit. Chloe Mendocino drives. That was good defense by Riverside there. And I apologize, Ava Schmidt is in the starting lineup for Holy Cross. And we're going to have a travel on Riverside. Cross passing everything outside the three-point line. Emma Scalise with a shot. Good. That's two. 440 left first quarter. Ava with another great defense. Madison Potter right up and in for two. Two more. Loose ball on the floor. Who gives it? Riverside gets it back. Punched out by Trista. Ava Schmidt goes right in. Up and and gets the roll for two. Oh. 
Riverside trying to run a four out, one in offense there. One girl is inside the three-point line. Everybody else is out. Straight up, we're going to have a foul on Ava. Two more for Riverside. Julie Walsh getting ready to check back in. First one's good. Julie checks in for Emma Scalise. Cross. Trista for two. Ava with a great rebound. Gets it back up. Gets her own rebound again and puts it in. Ava Schmidt with another two. That's four for her already. Eight to two. Holy Cross is up. Oh, good steal by Madison. Give and go, just underneath. Chloe looking. Julie gets it over to Madison. Madison for two. Off the back of the rim. Good box off by Riverside right there. We're going to have a double dribble on Riverside. Emma Luciani checking in for Ava. Holy Cross is going to be running a five out offense against a zone defense for Riverside. Give and go. Kick out to Chloe. Chloe strong on the shot. Chloe, very good defense. And we're going to have a foul. Two shots. Great defense by Chloe. Great awareness to see that. Ball was just kind of thrown out there. Out onto the outlet. Gets the steal. Drives to the basket. Gets the foul. Chloe gets the first. Chloe's up, gets the second. Ten to two, Holy Cross. Have a travel on Riverside. Trista. And we're going to have a travel. We got a timeout, Holy Cross. 30 second timeout.
Take watch. Nice drive by Riverside right there. Gets the foul for two. First one's good. Second one's good. Ten to four. Here comes Holy Cross hurrying the ball down the floor pretty quickly here. Riverside still with the zone. Nice look by Emma inside. Too strong for Chloe. We're gonna have a. What are we gonna have? We are gonna have a push. by Julie forty eight seconds left first quarter all tipped good twenty nine seconds left plenty of time nice look short on the rebound Rebound Riverside. I'm sorry, short on the shot. Rebound Riverside. Drives right to the basket, kicks out. Ten seconds left. Shot off the rim. Two. Julie Walsh with a travel. And that's the end of the quarter. Holy Cross 10, Riverside 4. Riverside ball coming out of the at the beginning of the second quarter. Nice dish for two, ten to six. Turnover by Holy Cross. Riverside with a travel right there. Starting the second quarter for Holy Cross. Madison Potter, Emma Scalise, Emma Luciani, Julie Walsh, and Ava Schmidt. Holy Cross still with that five out. Emma Luciani for three, drills it. Oh, 
Emma with a great catch and shot right there. Great look for the assist. I believe that was Madison. Ooh, we're going to have an offensive foul right there. Great call on that illegal screen. Is up. Emma Scalise with a three. Just off the rim. Rebound Riverside. She's going to drive right to the rim. Kick out. Nice shot by Madison. Holy Cross up by five. A two. Madison long. Ball was thrown out of bounds by Riverside. Turnover, Holy Cross ball. <laughs> Give and go kick. Ava for three. Just short. Double bounce off the rim. It's going to be Riverside ball. Loose ball on the floor. Who's going to come up with it? Bodies all over the floor. We're going to have a jump ball. Holy cross ball. Chicoletti for three. Off the front of the rim. Ava Schmidt. Rebound. the freshman oh kicked it and we're gonna have a foul on Riverside right there great defense by Trista Emma Scalise coming back in for Madison Potter There's a turnover by Holy Cross. Those are things that you're going to have to start working on. Have to limit those unforced turnovers. And we're going to have a foul on Trista. Shot too strong. Ava with the rebound. We're gonna have a held ball. Gonna be Riverside ball. <laughs> Riverside stuck in that corner. Still Riverside ball. Tip by Holy Cross. 321 left, second quarter. Aaron throw, oh, double dribble on Emma. Great defense here tonight by Holy Cross JV team. Making it very difficult for them to, for Riverside to score. See if 
we limit these turnovers for the last three minutes of the half. Chloe Mendocino kicks out to Emma. Emma shot just off. Ava with another offensive rebound. She must have three or four of them. Gonna have another held ball. It's gonna be Holy Cross ball. Julie Walsh is gonna be checking in for Emma Luciani. 2.54 left. Second quarter. Chloe Mendocino long on that shot. Oh, eight. Stops short and gets the ball. Puts it in for another two for Ava. Excellent defense right there. Ava having her best, and we're going to have a hand check on Emma. Ball's on the floor again. Trista Ciccoletti gets it out to Julie Walsh. Julie Walsh loses the handle. Riverside ball. I have to say, Holy Cross's defense so far in this first half has been really good. And another steal, Emma Scalise. And Emma unfortunately couldn't keep handle on it, tried to kick it back. Out of bounds, Holy Cross Riverside ball. Good defense by Julie. Knocking that right back out of bounds. For those thinking that that was a travel, that was not a travel because she did not roll over. Good defense by Chloe Mendocino. I don't know if Riverside has five shots on the night. Here's a three. Ava Schmidt for three. She is having herself one heck of a half. So that is not a travel because she didn't roll. You could slide all the way down the floor. You just can't roll. Across, nice drive, and we're going to have a foul. It's going to be Chloe's second. Two shots for Riverside. First one's up, and good. <laughs> 109 left, second quarter. Second one's up, and off, rebound. Riverside. Emma Scalise really bringing that ball down the floor. Chloe Mendocino kicks it out. Trista for three, too long. Ava with another rebound. It's back to Ava. Julie fighting for that ball. They're fighting for that ball. It's on the floor, and it is going to be Riverside ball. Forty-two seconds left, first half. Holy Cross and man defense. Good defense by Ava there. Ava is having a half. She has to have 11 points. And we'll get back to that. After the half, I will get you an update on how many points she has, but she's having one heck of a game. Emma Scalise for three. Too strong. 
Riverside's going to be going for the last shot. Eight seconds left. Six seconds left. Ava with another great defense. And we're going to have .6 seconds left. Ava is playing excellent today. And now Crusaders, Lady Crusaders up 20 to 9. We're going to take a break. We'll be back.
And we will side will be getting the ball to start the second half. I'm sorry, Holy Cross will be getting the ball to start the second half. Starting the second half for Holy Cross is Ava Schmidt, Chloe Mendocino, Julie Walsh, Madison Potter, who just took that shot, missed, and Emma Scalise. Holy Cross and man defense. Now this is the first league game. Old Forge does not have it, and a drive on Madison Potter. Old Forge doesn't have a JV team, so this is Holy Cross' first JV league game. First one's good. Twenty to. 10. Second one's good. Good defense by Riverside right there. Emma got caught in a trap. Good hands not to foul. We're going to have a three long and oh, not. Bounce right off Chloe's leg. Keep it Riverside ball. Nice pass. Just missed. Emma Scalise getting the ball up. Riverside in a zone, two, three. Chloe Walsh gets it to Ava. Ava too strong on the shot. And Julie's going to get hit with a foul. Going to be a block. Pass inside, up, and good block by Ava. Ava, strong to get that ball out of there. She had two goals on it. Matt, she gets stopped. Ava, great call. Ava Schmidt with an 22-11 Holy Cross leads. Nice move. Group. Lead is nine. Madison for three. Off. Ava with a great rebound right there. Emma for three. Too strong. And Ava almost with another offensive rebound. Just out of her reach. Julie Walsh. <laughs> Emma going in for Ava. Ava deserves that break. Four minutes left, third quarter. 22-13, Holy Cross is up. Cross gets it. Madison for three from the corner. Just... Short. 
Emma right into Chloe. Chloe going to make that move. Block. Great defense there by Riverside. Pass in and oh, just great defense there by Holy Cross. And an release. We're going to have a fun. Short on the free throw, Emma Scalise. She is a runner. She's quick. Gets it right into Chloe. Another block. Gets it in a nice rebound and shot. 24-15. Three long. Emma Scalise with the rebound. Slows it down just a touch. And a travel. In for Holy Cross is number four, Shelby Hartland. In for Emma Scalise. And a travel on Riverside. Another unforced error by Holy Cross. Shelby throwing it way over the head of Julie. Oh, we're going to have a foul on Emma. Two shots for Riverside. First one's good. Second one is good. Gets the roll. Brings it down to seven. Shut turnover. And we are going to have a trap. Ava returns, giving Madison a break. Good block by Riverside there. Great defense by Emma. Knocked that ball away on that entry pass. Gets it into Chloe. Chloe's going to go to the line shooting two. First one's off. Second one's up. Too strong. Rebound Riverside. Lead is still seven. Holy Cross with only four points so far this quarter. Riverside with the second chance point. Emma with the foul, two shots. Shot, 
First one short. Second one's up, and that one's short, too. Julie with the rebound. Julie picking up the... And another unforced error. That's three or four of them already in this third quarter for Holy Cross. Got to get back to the way they were playing in the first half. Limited turnovers, great passing, excellent shots. See if they can get off the snide here. Chloe tries to get, and we're going to have... An Nice drop for two. Lead is five. Holy Cross. Holy Cross ball. Julie trying to drive through. Oh, sorry about that. My cameraman is home sick. Chloe out to Ava. Ava takes the shot. Too strong. Emma. Julie, excellent tip by Emma. Out to Chloe. Emma. Ava. Ava with the shot. Short. And she couldn't catch up to it. It's going to be Holy Cross ball, or I'm sorry, Riverside ball, 40.6 seconds left. Five-point lead for Holy Cross. Oh, good defense by Julie. 30.8 seconds left. Riverside ball still great defense, though, by Julie. Now Holy Cross should get the ball if there's no more jumps to start the fourth quarter. Drive to basket, and we're gonna have it. Riverside having they do have a tough time getting it in. See if Holy Cross here can get two for one, really. Julie over to Shelby. Shelby for three. Off the mark. Nine seconds left. Julie with the rebound. Six seconds left. Four. Julie with a three. Off the mark. And there is the end of the third quarter. Riverside with 11 points that quarter. Holy Cross is four. Just a reminder, we'll, we, we will have a pregame show about five minutes before the tip of the varsity game. We'll have some stats for you on Riverside, how they're doing so far this season, as well as their leading scorer, who Holy Cross has to stop. Some for Holy Cross to win this.
We're going to have Holy Cross ball coming out. Starting the fourth quarter is Julie Walsh, Madison Potter, Emma Scalise, Emma Luciani, and Ava Schmidt. And we're going to have a push underneath. It's going to be Holy Cross ball. Out to Emma in the corner. Gets to Ava. Swinging around pretty quick. Madison Potter off. She has yet to hit one. Rebound Riverside. Side. Oh, just over the outstretched arms. We cross trying to get Emma Scalise for three. Yeah. Bucket for Holy Cross. Emma Scalise is a junior. Julie with great Emma diving on that floor, getting it out by those two. See if Madison could catch up, and she couldn't, but off of Riverside. Holy Cross ball. Ariana Cabelli in, Cabelli in for Emma Luciani. Uh, bad pass there by Julie. And we're probably going to have a foul right there. I can see it from half court. Foul is going to be on Madison. That is her first. Here's the second. And the lead. Or I'm sorry, six. 27 21. Holy Cross is up. Let's see if Holy Cross can have a little bit of a, um, a run here. Another three. Good. Emma hit the last two. Brings it up to nine. Oh, and Emma Scalise with great. She's coming through. Missed the layup. Madison Potter almost corralled it just out of her reach. Bounced it out of bounds. It's going to be Riverside Ball. All Emma needs to do there is get to one side of the basket or the other instead of going straight on like that. That's that's hard. Drive right to the bat. Nice pass. And one. That's going to be on Ava. Sorry, they corrected Madison's foul. She has two. That's second for Ava. Lead is now seven. Short on the shot. Rebound Riverside. Rebound Holy Cross. Gets it out to Emma Scalise. There is nothing easy with Emma Scalise there as Coach Bob. Coach Bob is screaming to go easy, but Emma Scalise just drives right to the bucket.
in the game. Holy Cross up by seven. Good block, and it's going to be Hell Ball, Riverside Ball. Oh, there's another illegal screen. Cross looking to work the ball around and almost a bad throw there. And another unforced turnover. There's no reason to make that pass over there when you're six inches away from each other. Keep your dribble, continue doing what you're doing. Riverside looking at great drive, good block. Grace steal. Madison Pop. Long. Ariana gets it and doesn't get the roll. Three oh nine left in the game. Thirty to twenty three. Great defense by Ava. And rolls around the back of the rim. How that didn't go in, I am not sure. Rebound, Emma. Madison for two. Gets it to go. Struggled a little bit today. Gets that one. That was just inside the three-point line. So only a two. Three for Riverside. Long. No box out by Rivers. A good defense, though. And there's a much ball off Holy Cross. Emma Luciani re-enters the game. Nice move, and doesn't get the roll. Should be heading the line for two. First one's good. Brings them to with eight. There's a second. Good. 24 left. Madison Potter for three. Brings it to a Madison starting to feel it now because hit her last missing quite a few. Great drive. Great entry pass. For two. Brings it to eight. We're having a back and forth contest here right now. And Madison is feeling it. Rimmed out. Rebound Riverside. 140 left. And that's a double dribble. Julie Walsh is going to re-enter the game for Kaylee Shelp.
Holy Cross running a five out off. Riverside and man. Excellent shot by Emma there, just long. Great rebound by Emma, good defense by Julie. Madison gets the ball, brings it up, gets it out to half court, and time out, Holy Cross. Gonna be a 60 second timeout. One minute left in the game. Eight. Emma Scalise off the side of the backboard. Emma Luciani with the drive. Great. Great drive there. Emma's going the line to shoot two. First one strong. Let's get this one for a nine point. Still three possession game. Gets the set. Nine point lead. 48 seconds left. Holy crap. Riverside is in the bonus. Wild shot there. Julie with the rebound. Holy Cross should be looking to waste this clock. Smart move by Emma there. Ava with a good spin move. Julie with a shot. Good. The game. Shouldn't be looking for any fouls from Holy Cross here. We're going to have a last second shot. And there it is, and there is the ball. 27. Lady Crusaders win. We'll be back in about 10.
Riverside High School, where the hosting Lady Vikings will be Lady Crusaders. A little bit about the Vikings. They are 4-5, and 1-0 and oh in the division, beating Carbondale on Monday, 53-32. They have beaten West Elk Lake and Hanover area. Common teams that we have played. Riverside beat West Granton by 43. Holy Cross beat them by about 10. And they also played Scranton, losing to Scranton. Uh, where is it? By 7. So not sure what we're going to get here. Their leading scorer is Lily Pond, who's a guard. She's a junior. She has, in those nine games, 153 points. So she's averaging just under 20 points a game, probably about 18 points per game, which is excellent. Their next leading scorer is Lexi Kostoff. She is a senior. So they're going to have to really watch those two girls. There's a little drop-off after that. Riverside is probably going to be playing hard defense, quick offense. Their new first season, Justin Carney, he is very aggressive. Now, to your Holy Cross Lady Crusaders, what are they going to do? Are we going to get the team that comes out against Scranton High and really play tough? They played hard. Get anything to drop in that line of tournament consolation game. But the, the, it looked like there was light at the end of the tunnel playing Old Forge. Nothing went right for them. The game down 10 nothing and couldn't catch up after that. Their game. The little flaws are not working. Easy steals for opposing teams, especially Riverside. They are very fast. It will get the and they'll take them right down to the other end for transition and fast layups. They need to work. get those outside checks. There is no shooting for Holy Cross. We have only eclipsed 30 points twice. Once against Riverside, or I'm sorry, once against West. And then the other time, I believe, was, let me look it up here real quick. I think it was Montrose. So they only have two times in eight games where they've eclipsed 30 points. That is unexpected. Really start putting the ball up in the air. and get Nobody is shooting that well. Nobody is shooting a lot to shoot that well. So we got a lot of things that we have to look at tonight. Hopefully they come out strong and can really do a good job against this Riverside defense. Start turning this season around. Monday they have Mid Valley. We will not be able to bring that game to you. They have, and I believe you could purchase it. Not sure. We will get details for you on that. Take a look on our Facebook page, on my Facebook page, Mike Luciani, to see any details about Monday's game. Today's game is brought to you by Riverfront Sports, where the good become great. So, tryouts for four. Take a look, go on riverfrontsports.com, click on the sports banner, come down, hit basketball, you'll see travel and club.
Bob McCormick, the assistant coach. Let's meet the starting lineup for Justin Carney's Lady Bucks. Where's number five, the junior, Zoe Simon Roberts. Freshman, where's number 11, Kylie Williams. Where's number 13, the senior, Lexi Costa. Where's number 31, the junior, Alexa Williams. And wearing number 24, junior, Willie Pye. Adam Joyce, the assistant coach. Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the playing of our national anthem. Official clock, Jamie Triscavi, Jack Lumley. The official trainer, Jared Bonda. Introducing our PIAA officials, Kevin Grassi, with the ball, along with Mark Price and Ron Rolinski. And here we go. See how Holy Cross starts off here. Riverside gets the ball. Kostov comes right up. Looked like she was going to shoot there for a second. Gets it to Lily. Abby Thompson is playing Lily hard. Holy Cross is in a man defense. And Abby has a tough assignment tonight. Lily Pond had 20 points against Corbindale area on Monday night in their first win. Great. Excellent defense, in my opinion. Her offense is a little nervous on offense. She really has to start off of Abby's face. She really has to start getting some just over Abby. Gets it back. Megan with she gets it out to. J Jenna looking to, gets it to Megan. Almost a travel there. She gets it back. Jenna, cost off on Jenna. Lexi. Jenna gets it to the corner to Juliana. Juliana comes out. Megan drives to the rim. Long on the shot, just strong. Lily Pond with the rebound. Lexi cost off. To three, it was all guard pond quick guard 
Williams, another quick guard. Blocked by And there's your first foul of the game. Number 24, Lily Pond. Pond with her first foul. Jenna Luciani for three off the front of the iron. Lily Pond with another rebound. Kostov takes it and gets it in. And they reset. Smart move. Two knocks. Allison Ross trying to get it in. Nice try. Oh, and it's going to be out of bounds on Jenna. Coach Fitz not happy with the rebounding right there. Screaming at the girls to get the ball. Grab that ball. Good defense by Megan. As I was saying before, Megan's playing pretty good defense this season so far. She just has to start getting more comfortable on offense. She got beat there, though. Three for Riverside. <laughs> Holy crap. On this possession. Passage for two. Holy Cross hat needs a kick. Right in, side, and a reset. Drive to the rim, kick. Oh. Cross really needs to start putting and there's a little hesitation by Megan that they need to fix and short gets knocked down no Lily Pond with the rebound and a Abby Thompson diving into the stands there to get the ball just couldn't save it Cost off for three. And it is not. This is exactly. You have to stop with these slow starts. 30 second timeout. These slow starts are really bad. The Lady Crusaders behind the eight ball. They really can't get going. And now they're always trying to play catch up. They need to get more aggressive on offense and limit their turnovers. <laughs> Coach Fitzgerald yelling out some instructions. Gets it to Abby. Abby into Megan. Megan kicks it out to Jenna. Jenna just about gets it knocked away. Allison Ross right there for it. Abby Thompson for three. This needs to go. Lily Pond. And an Aaron Pond. Out of bounds. Can't be giving Riverside these extra chances. Get that ball. You see that ball coming up in three. You're, you're going to grab it and go. A nice drive. Too strong. Lily Palm with the rebound. And she's going to go to the line for two. Allison Ross, number one on the 
first. Here's the first. Gets it. Leads eight. And the second looks good, is good. It is now a nine point lead. Allison Ross for three. Brings it within six. Nice try. Strong off the rim and it's going to be Riverside ball. Holy Cross needs to box out. Not boxing out so far in this first quarter. Three more, six left. Everybody straight up and Holy Cross ball. Riverside man defense right here. Nice pass. Juliana, Juliana. Rebound, Lexi Kostov, who brings it right down the floor. Great defense right there. And a three strong. Again, no boxing out. Left her wide open. Pon with a Jenna Luciani with the rebound. Gianna or Juliana Maza ball. Riverside ball. Riverside kicks it back out. Cost off with Ross on it. We're going to have a foul on Abby. Number 31, Abby Thompson. First person, team second. Good switch there. Good talk by Holy Cross. Lexi Kostoff for three, banks at nothing. Juliana Maza brings it down, lead is still six, 12-6. Holy Cross with a five. Still Little drive, jump, stop, and shoot. Lily Pond bringing the ball up. 55 seconds left, first quarter. Holy Cross playing pretty good defense as of right now. Drive and kick and a three. Long on the three, Megan Hassan. Juliana Mazza for three, short, rims in and out. Allison Ross, block. And we're going to have a Riverside ball. Alexa Williams checks in for the Lady Lights. Where's number 31? 30 second timeout, Riverside. Alexa Williams checking in the game for Riverside. Check the three for. Girl that hit the three pointer previously for Riverside was Kylie Williams. Trista Ch 
Ciccoletti checking in the game for Megan Hassah. Coach Fitz going a little bit defense right now. Riverside really doesn't have anybody that's tall, so I don't think Coach Fitzgerald needs to worry about height tonight. Just needs to worry about that speed. And there's an excellent drive. Trisha Ciccoletti gets the rebound, brings it down. She's going to go right to the rim. Allison Ross with the move. Six. Lexi the first quarter, 15. So this is what Holy Cross needs to keep avoiding. They keep getting down by 8, 9, 10 points after the first quarter. Now they got to dig themselves out of this hole they created. It looks like Chloe Mendocino is going to check in. I'm not sure for who. So let's see if Holy Cross. It's only nine points. Still a ton of time in this game. They just don't want to get down by 15, 20. By That's a big hole to dig out of when you're in high school. It's going to be... And it looks like Chloe is in for Allison Ross. So you got Trista Ciccoletti, Juliana Maza, Chloe Mendocino, Abby Thompson and Jenna Luciani starting this second quarter. Abby all over Lily, giving her all. Oh, and that's two for her. two in and out. Thompson. Gets it up gets it to Juliana. Juliana driving. Holds it up and resets it up at the top. Thompson looking for help. She gets a rebound. Here comes that. Luciani for three. To Long. Ball is loose. And a left. Shelly Kostov. Looks like a walk. But wasn't. Shot. Juliana Mott. Holy Cross needs points. And these Luciani rims in and out. She's 0 for 3 from three point range. On the floor, Trista Ciccoletti's looking around, gets the ball, gets it to Jenna. Jenna gets to Juliana. They got numbers here. And we are going to have an offensive foul. Juliana's first. Holy Cross is third. Holy Cross is shooting. They just are not. Getting the ball in the back, and we're going to have a foul on Trista Ciccoletti. The first one's good for Lexi, and it's now a 10 point lead. Second one's up and good, 11 point lead. Now Holy Cross definitely needs some points on the board right now. 
Tristan gets it in to Chloe. Chloe gets up and rims out. Tristan with a rebound. Abby Thompson for three. Off the mark. And now there's big numbers here for Riverside. And great defense by Juliana Mazza. Not giving up on the on defense. Knocking it out of the bounds. Jenna Brink coming out to make sure that they get that pass. That Lily had to make that pass. Coach Fitz is really giving it to the officials. There's a mismatch underneath. Great defense by Trista. She gets the rebound and then the ball's kicked out. What hustle by Lily Pond. A little bit of a crazy series right there. I think there was three turnovers in a matter of three seconds. Ah, pass was too high. And we're going to have a jump ball. It is going to be Holy Cross ball. This game last year here at Riverside went into overtime. What a thriller it was. I am hoping for something like that tonight. Jenna's going to take that. Oh, nope. Chloe right in. She put it down. And the ball is going to be backcourt. Chloe shouldn't put that ball on the floor. She should go right up with it. Now Trista is taking on Lexi Kostoff, sophomore versus senior. Kick out. Williams short. We're going to have another jump ball. And those two girls, Lily Pond and Abby Thompson, they won't give an inch. We're going to have a foul first. We're going to have a call on Riverside. A hold. Cassidy Merrifield with the foul. Team second. Her first. Oh. Chloe Mendocino back in. Up long on the shot. Chloe's going to have to learn to get that body around to get, get more points. Second quarter has not been kind to Holy Cross. We're going to have a foul. Who was that on? That was on Abby Thompson. Abby with her second team's fifth. Abby is all over her tonight. Shot by Williams. We're going to have a push, and we're going the other way. Come on, Abby. Keep working. Lily Pond with her second, and she's going to have to come out. Allison Ross going in for Chloe Mendocino. Great job by Chloe. She's just got to turn those shoulders a little bit more. We're going to have an official timeout. Question about Allison Ross. She had to change her jersey. She had blood on her jersey. So she changed from her usual number, what I think is two to 22. So Allison is now 22. Pass over to Trista, Trista to Jenna underneath. Jenna to, their passing is a little better tonight. Not much, but a little better. And Abby Thompson for three, long on the three. Trista Ciccoletti trying to get that rebound. But rebound by Alexis. Williams. 345 left, and Holy Cross has yet to put a point on the board in this second quarter. Second quarter, as I said before, has just been murder for Holy Cross. Good screen. 
It's up to Williams. Williams, I right, she went up and got that one. And Fitz is going way upset. Just to Chicoletti with the rebound. Gets it out to Allison. Allison brings it around. 315 left. Chicoletti kicks it back to Allison. Allison fakes the shot. Back up top, resets. Juliana went up. She got blocked and now coming back for Riverside. Great block by Allison. Allison gets it out to Abby. Abby turns her defender. And we're going to have a foul. Abby's going to the line shooting two. See if Holy Cross can get off the snide. I think they had a five, about five minutes. Or I'm sorry. About eight minutes since they've scored. These long droughts kill them. Allison gets the first. Or I'm sorry. Abby gets the first to go. Good, is good. Drops the lead to nine. And they were sorely needed. Riverside taking their time getting up the floor. Abby now has Lexi Kostov. Zimmerovich almost stolen. Zoe with a great drive. Alexis Williams with the grab and put back. Holy Cross has to stop these second chance points. Jenna. Nice pass, Jenna with a left hand for two. That's her first two points in the game. It's a great caught, great left hand. Great cut, nice move. Rebound, Trista gets it to Juliana. And here she goes. Juliana out to Al Allison, hits that three, banked it. Abby Thompson with the rebound, gets it to Juliana, puts it on the floor, and we're gonna be shooting two more. the first. Lily Pond coming back into the game. Kylie Williams coming back into the game. Kylie's just a freshman. Here comes the second. And long. I think she's missed two free throws all year. Gets it down to eight. Kick out. Lucky that pass was Aaron. That would have been a, an easy three. And a bounce pass. Zoe Zimmerovich bounce pass out of bounds. Now Riverside is going to provide some pressure. Get it in. Girls got to get it. And there's a bad pass. These are the passes. These passes and these unforced turnovers are what kills Holy Cross also. Out, Kylie Williams. Three, cost off, off the mark. Trista gets the rebound. She's getting stuck, and now she's stuck for sure. Timeout. Holy Cross. Eight point game, 19 11. 50. Four seconds left. So 
But for Riverside, they only have three girls they really got to worry about the outside shot, that three-pointer. It's Lily Pond, Leslie Kostoff, and Kylie Williams. They're the only ones so far that have three-point shots. Check that. And Zoe Zimarovich has nine. So there's four girls that could shoot that three. There's Holy Cross. They get it in. Jenna's asked them to clear it out. She's going to cross her over. She gets it down the floor. Abby Thompson gets it in. Tristan Ciccoletti and that bad pass again. Those passes are killing them. Great pass, great, better defense. Juliana Mazza, too strong on the layup. She shoots the two way short. Lily Pond, Zimarovich with the three, gets it to go. And the lead's now 12, 13 seconds left. 22-11, sorry, 11. 22-11, there's seven seconds left. They gotta get this going. There's five seconds left. Juliana Mazza, deep three, drills it at the buzzer! Your halftime score, 22-14. Holy Cross still needs to take care of the ball a little bit better in this second half. That first half was a little tough. A uh, couple passes that weren't all that great. Got to get those passes better. Also, they're not shooting. Enough, in my opinion. They got to shoot the ball better. More shots will we'll get you more points. They're just not shooting enough. And we will be back at the start of the second half.
again, welcome to the second half. Abby Thompson is playing excellent defense against Lily Pond. I, she might have two points, maybe zero. So Lily is quite frustrated here tonight. Not having a typical game. So she is definitely... We'll have to see if Abby can keep up the good work on defense. Holy Cross needs to score more points. They've got to get the ball up and in shots and they got to put it in the basket. They need way more shots. Double the amount of shots that they had in that first half. Jenna is one for four. For her shots with two points. Juliana Mazza hit a three and I think three out of four free throws. She's got six. She's probably the leading scorer. Coming in for Holy Cross starting is going to be Juliana Mazza, Jenna Luciani, Abby Thompson, Trista Ciccoletti, and Allison Ross to start this second half, and it is going to be our ball. Riverside providing some pressure. Gets it out to Abby. Abby, seeing what she could do. Turns her defender, turns her defender again, turns her defender again. Three times that we're going to have an offensive. Nope. We're going to have a foul on Kylie Williams. Phenom freshman for Riverside. See if Holy Cross can cut into this lead quick this half. Kylie Williams, freshman playing spectacular defense right now. Abby Thompson driving to the basket, blocked by Lexi Kostov. A little bit of frustration drive right there by Abby. She needs to take her time, plenty of time left in this game for her to get her points in. Right into Abby, bad pass though. Abby gets it, kicks it back to Jenna. Jenna gets Trish Ciccoletti, Ciccoletti to Juliana for three. The lead is five. Kostov taking her time, bringing the ball down the floor. Trista Ciccoletti has a tough assignment tonight too. And look at the play by Abby Thompson and Lily Pond underneath. Abby Thompson straight up, great defense, great help. And Mazza with the, re the, the ball. You got help coming in, gets it to Jenna Luciani, and she's going to get it back to Juliana and get it up the floor. What help defense by Allison Ross there against. Ball's going in, and we're going to have a foul on Zoe Zimirovic. That is going to be their third and a half already. I'm sorry, second and a half. Coach is giving a lot of talk to the refs tonight. Trista Ciccoletti gets back off to Juliana. Back to Jenna. Jenna right back to Mazza. Mazza kicks it out to Abby Thompson for three short. Rebound Pond. Kicks it out to Zoe. Zoe for three. And we're going to have a foul on Allison Ross. her first six point lead second one's up strong Abby Thompson with the rebound she takes her time getting it up the floor to Jenna Jenna to Allison Ross Allison gets it to Allison Allison gets bumped straight up Coach Fitzgerald screaming that he wants a foul there. Both coaches really giving it to him. We're going to have a foul on. Abby Thompson, that's three. On her. I didn't see that very well. Maybe she grabbed Kostov. And they're just all over Lily Pond tonight. 
Pond kicks it to Zimmerovic. Zimmerovic for three, gets it. Lead back up to nine. Timeout, Holy Cross. So Holy Cross has been putting up way more shots so far at the beginning of this second half than they have in the first half. So if they could keep that going, they could definitely start making a run here, cutting to that lead, and hopefully be in position to win the game towards the end. So we'll see how this goes, see how this holds up. That inbounds play is really starting to kill them underneath because they're just getting it right to the block. Somebody's driving down the, the lane, getting the defense to collapse and then just kicking it out for a three. From the stats, what I saw, Riverside is living off threes this year. Jenna Luciani gets it to Juliana. Juliana back to Gen Jenna. J to Trista, Trista to G. G gets it to Allison, Allison will take that. And she drops it through! Holy Cross needs to have a stop here. Trista is going to have a foul right there. That's Trista's second. First one goes for Lexi Kostoff. One is up and out. Seven point lead. Allison Ross is going to go right to the rim. No call. Kicks it back. Trista with a great rebound. Kicks it back out to Alice or Abby. Abby to Juliana. Juliana for three. Short. Trista with a good play. Just didn't get it to the right girl. Zoe Zimarovic decides to hold it up. Very smart choice. And Abby Thompson's going to have her fourth. Megan Hassan is going to have to come in for, for Abby. 4.53 left in the third quarter, and Abby's going to have to sit a lot. And a three for Kylie. Rims in and out. And Megan just watched it go out of bounds. Riverside kicks it out. Here comes Lily with the drive. Up, she's going to get the foul. She's going to be shooting two. I think the only two points Lily has had tonight have been on free throws. Shooting two, just off to the right. One shot. Holy Cross needs a good run right here. Cutting to that lead before we get to that fourth quarter. Get it under five. Second one's good. Eight point lead. And Riverside now gonna give some pressure. It's soft pressure. Allison Ross gets the ball up the floor. Trista. Megan Hassaz, they're going to leave her out there. Jenna Luciani takes the three and drops it through. Five-point lead for Riverside. And that's Jenna's fifth point of the night. And Lexi Kostov just takes it right to the rim. 
30 second timeout Riverside. I think Lexi cost off just a little too much for Trista to handle. They're going to have to make a little switch here on on defense. Figure out how who they're going to match up with. The lead is now seven. Be Holy Cross ball. They're setting up their Riverside's probably setting up their press. All five of their girls are in the backcourt. So they're going to have to be careful with the ball coming up this floor. Gets it into Trista. Trista back to Jay. Jay brings it up. It's a soft press. It's to Allison. Allison in the corner, drives to the basket, gets it up, and straight up, great block. And Zoe Zimmerovich decides to pull it out and reset their offense. Kylie Williams drives to the basket, gets it blocked. Juliana Mazza gets the ball, and here she goes up the floor, brings it back. Oh, that's a very ill-advised pass. To Lily Pond, Lily Pond up and missed. And Allison loses control. Tipped by Riverside. Holy cross ball. Kostoff playing good defense against Jenna. Allison, Allison over to Trista. Trista for three. That's going to be a little long. Megan Hassage trying to get that rebound. Great rebound by Lily Pond. She might not be putting the points up tonight, but she's doing everything else. There's a two. Strong. And the shooter got the rebound. That can't happen. As soon as that shot goes up, Holy Cross girls have to have a body on them. There goes Kostoff again. What a drive. And he gets it through out to Megan. Megan to Trista. Trista to Jay. Jay to Ab Allison. Allie to Jay. Jay dribbles. Crossover by Jay straight up. Too strong. On the drive to the basket. The lead is nine. On to Alexis, too strong. Rebound blocked by Jenna again. That's three tonight. Zoe Zimmerovich and Lexi Kostoff decides that she's gonna take it out and reset. Very smart by oh, Lexi. Back up top. Oh, great cut by Lily Pond. Straight up and gets the roll. Lead is now 11. This is going in the wrong direction for Holy Cross here. They need to get some points on this board now. Here comes Jenna. We're going to have a push. Chloe Mendocino comes in for Megan Hassa. Abby still sitting due to those four fouls. Juliana is too strong. Chloe Mendocino can't get the rebound and Kostoff with it. Gets it to Lily Pond. Now Jenna has the tough assignment of Kostoff. Switch on that one. Ball bounced off of Chloe's foot. Zimirovich for three, gets it. And now it is a 14 point lead.
45 seconds left, first half. Mendocino gets called for the travel first. So the end of this third quarter did not go the way that Holy Cross wanted. I'm sure Riverside is going to be looking for the last shot here. Riverside expanding their lead by six from halftime. And a pass, great defense by Trista for the steal. She's going right in. Kicks it out to Allison, Allison to Jenna. Jenna blocked by Lily Pond. And Lily Pond loses the handle. 12 seconds left. Gets it to Jenna, Jenna back to Juliana. Juliana for a long two. Long on the shot, two seconds left. And the ball bounces around to end the third quarter. So Riverside had 15 points that quarter to Holy Cross's nine. say the ball the ball control and and ball security for Holy Cross was a little bit better in that third quarter still need to have better ball control it's gonna be Riverside ball coming out at start this fourth quarter let's see who Barry has coming out for this fourth quarter He has start in this fourth quarter. Ava Schmidt, who had a great JV game. Jenna Luciani, Trista Ciccoletti. And a great steal by Jenna there. She's going to bring that ball up. Allison Ross and uh, Juliana Maza. And a great pass in and a foul. We're going to have two. That is the third foul on Zimmerovitz. Jay gets the first to drop, brings the lead to 13. Second one's up, it's gonna be short, way short. Trista with a very hard assignment on Garden. Nice drive, just strong on it. She was expecting a foul. That got held up. Excellent defense by Holy Cross there. Ava, great defense by Riverside there on that play. Oh, she should have stayed straight. Pond with the rebound. Off a nice play, and we're going to have a foul. How that got through all the Holy Cross girls, I will never know. That zipped through three girls to get to white. Trista's fourth. First one is no good for Alexis Williams. Let's see if Holy Cross can make a little run here to get this game within reach. And Abby Thompson's going to come back in. Second one is good. And there's a 14 point lead again. And Abby comes in for Trista. So Abby is going to have to be careful. Pressure by Riverside. 
Again, a little bit of soft pressure. Ava Schmidt, phenom freshman for Holy Cross. Abby down on the block, straight up. Jenna Luciani from the corner, long, way long. Rebound Abby, and we're gonna have a double dribble. Six forty left, fourth quarter. Riverside taking their time to get in there, and nice play. Missed the rebound, and nobody could get the rebound. Holy Cross gets lucky there. Kylie Williams comes in. Again, Riverside with this soft press, just kind of take time off the clock. They get a loose ball, they get a loose ball. Just like that, lazy passes. Lazy passes. Juliana, Juliana, everybody else clears out. Lexi Kostoff just provides a little bit of pressure. Gets it to Ava. Ava gets it to G. G to J. Jenna gets by the hip. Kicks it to Allison. Allison for three. Just short. That was a great kick. I think Coach Fitzgerald wanted her to shoot that layup. Now Jenna playing defense on Kostov. Jenna's probably one of their better defenders. Good screen. Lily Pond with excellent position. Great pass. It was a great entry pass. 16 point lead now. Al Abby Thompson with the cut. Short on the layup. Riverside now has control. Kostov, great defense by Jenna there. Kostov had her on the hip. Jenna was able to step up and get in front. Now he wants her way up. Coach Fitzgerald wants her playing, getting five counts. Great drive with the left hand. Coach Fitzgerald has to call timeout. Holy Cross down by 18, 457 left, fourth quarter. Holy Cross just cannot muster points when they need them. Somebody is going to have to be that go-to girl and take over and Call for the ball to put the bat ball in the basket. Whether that's Juliana or Jenna, Allie, Abby, somebody has to take control. Again, Monday's game will not be brought to you by Holy Cross YouTube channel. Mid Valley has their own broadcast, which you do have to pay for. I will have information on that on my Facebook page. Sorry about that. My cameraman is sick at home. Oh, and there's a nice steal by Lily. That is now a 20-point lead. This is where Holy Cross gets silly. They got to stop it and just play. Stop trying to force. Chicoletti for three. Off the mark. And boy... Allison Ross and Alexis Williams are really going at it. Three, good. Great 
Great play by Allison there. Three off the mark. Now we're shooting threes. Got to get points. Can't be shooting these threes coming up empty. Nice drive by the freshman. Allison, or Abby for two. It's gonna be Holy Cross ball. Ava coming back in for Jenna. Jenna needs a break. She was gasping for air. Great fake by Juliana. Can't get the floater to go. Ball stolen, and we're gonna have a travel. The lead has ballooned to 25, 49-24 Riverside. Ava Schmidt for three. Way off on that one. And there's Abby Thompson and Lily Pond. Again, won't give each other an inch. Looks like Holy Cross is going to come up short. Much better showing, though, here tonight than other nights. Just on defense. Just has to get rid of the silly turnovers and forcing the ball work into spots that they can't get it into. They could just play their game for a full four quarters. I think they'd be pretty competitive. They just haven't been able to do it. Chicoletti for three, long. Lily Pond with the rebound. Now it looks like Coach Carney is just gonna go with straight Four corners play. The old Dean Smith. And there goes Zoe Zimmerovich. She misses the layup and nobody's boxing out. Timeout Riverside. And Coach Fitzgerald is doing a bench clear. Other than about an eight minute stretch between the first quarter and the second quarter, Holy Cross has done better on offense. They just got to be more aggressive on that offensive side of that ball. Riverside has three starters in and two of their main subs still in the game. 2.20 left. We're going to have a foul on Chloe. In the game for Holy Cross, Sadie Sokolowski, Madison Potter, Emma Emma Scalise, Chloe Walsh, Chloe Mendocino. One-on-one for Lily Pond. First one's up, in and out. Sadie with the rebound, gets it to Madison. Madison to Julie, Julie over to Chloe. Chloe dribbles a couple times, we're gonna have a foul. <clears throat> and 
And Riverside's doing a bench clear. Chloe for two, rims in and out. Madison with the rebound, gets to Emma. Emma back to Madison, Madison for three, short. Madison gets that rebound and there's gonna be a fight in a jump ball, Riverside ball. So Holy Cross is gonna drop to 0 and 2 in division play, one and eight overall. Madison Potter trying to poke that ball out. Riverside is going to be 2-0 and oh in the division and 5-5 five and five overall. Three for Riverside just off. And they're going to have another fight underneath and it should be... Holy, should be Holy Cross ball, it is. Riverside's pressing. Nope, they're going back. A little confusion. Emma Scalise for three, way long. Chloe Mendocino with the rebound, 118 left in the game. Sadie, senior, way off. Chloe Mendocino fighting Julie, and we're going to have a foul. Riverside actually took this game with two runs. One in the second quarter and one in the beginning of this fourth quarter. Shot by Emma Scalise, short. And now we got 55 seconds left. And that's the difference in this game. Holy Cross again have trouble putting points on the board. We're going to have an uh, offensive foul. Illegal screen. So our next broadcast isn't going to be until next Thursday. We'll bring that to you live, both the JV and the varsity. They're going to have a foul. And Madison's going to be shooting one-on-one. -on -one. Up, short. Chloe Mendocino goes high for the rebound. Madison gets it back, gets it to Emma Scalise, who shoots for three, short. Sadie gets it, Madison for three, and just short. Chloe Mendocino, ball's rolling around on the floor. We're going to have a jump off. 15 point feet, three seconds left, Riverside ball. Riverside has Old Forge on Monday, beat Holy Cross. That should be a good game. Riverside's just, oh, Emma Scalise still playing. Good job. Three seconds left, two seconds left, one second left, and that is the game. Final score here at Riverside Junior Senior High School. Riverside 49, Holy Cross 24. Hopefully Holy Cross can get off this weekend, do a little bit of practice, and start scoring some more. they got to get some more points into that basket there. This just scoring in the 20s just is not going to work. So we will see what happens Monday night at Mid Valley. JV tip is at six. Varsity is about 7.15. If you can make it, get there. Good night, everybody.